I wasn't nervous at all about Lily and the rest of the fam, Nash and all them and Hodge until I saw the title of this episode for some reason. The Lives of the Village in the Sticks. Like there's only one village in the sticks we know about is Hodge. What's going to happen to Hodge? What's up Dapper Squad, it's your boy Darius back at it again with Black Clover episode 101, very happy to say that. Um, last episode we had an amazing, amazing, amazing fight between Asta, Yuno, Licked, I mean Klaus and Hammond were in there as well but they got absolutely demolished and now, oh my god, I literally cannot get over that fight and then fuck, and it ended with Licked using Yuno's magic that he absorbed in his demon uh dweller sword and shot it back and it absolutely eviscerated the entire area like we had zora trying to protect mary leona we had nozzle trying to protect n and everyone else and then at the end it showed you know like or asa like knocked out and the the third demon sword that was with lick kind of went in his grimoire so i have questions about that i need answers i need to know why this one has to do with hodge very curious i say we hop right on into this i'm super excited don't forget, if you guys want early access and full length, this show and all the other shows I'm watching, we are four episodes ahead on Patreon. Links are down in the description, like always, for you guys. Make sure to check that out. These episodes are fantastic. I know you want to watch the full length versions of them. Don't forget to subscribe. Click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Follow all the social medias, Instagram, Twitch, TikTok, Twitter, at Dapper Darius. Much, much appreciated. Let's hop into this. Black Clover, episode 101, The Lives of the Village and the Sticks. Let's do this. That moment was so dope, they had to show it to me again. And I don't blame them. Look at the power of that. Actually mind blown. Literally straight through their headquarters. And he just comes down all majestic like. He's still not fully awakened to the point where he can talk yet? What does he mean by that? Give me some answers. So you know, was super clutch, able to get us out of there. Yeah, let's all regroup, recuperate, talk about our next plan of action, because this is not good. Oh, and they have a spatial magic user with Cobb. That's so OP, they can go wherever now. Five hundred years. Don't tell me they can drive this base like it's a ship. Uh huh. The whole base moves. Uh huh. Yeah, thank goodness she's okay. She went through it. Yeah, I would let her rest. Yeah, should give you a little clue. Indicating how strong he is. Alias Booth. That's dope. It's like a back to tank from Star Wars. Of course, Naza would have that on him in case he got into an inst you know a situation where he had to use it. That's a dope magic item. Like that's something you can do. Just send your hurt your owies to someone else. Oh, that's handy. All the captains have it. A man just got murdered. Okay, I like the resolve. I double like that resolve. You must save the kingdom, no matter at what cost. You can always rebuild. He did say it's been a while. Yeah, I, it's been so long I missed, but maybe that was luck in there, not 
not wanting to damage Noel. I'm curious. I could see that. <laughs> Just like you know, Klaus had a small reaction as well. The question is, how do we awake them? Look at Noel taking the lead. I love this. Yeah, what do you got to say, Nazel? Yeah, that's your little sis right there going ham. Oh, I don't like the sound of that because Golden Dawn used to mean good. Now it means bad. Don't tell me they brought their base over here. What's oh, do they want to resurrect the demon? They literally brought the look at the size of their village compared to the base. That's literally insane. Yeah, I wouldn't be able to see either, but holy sh Oh, okay. It's not stopping. It kept going. It is heading towards the capital. I was nervous. I was nervous. Did they have a they, they have a magic knight in Hodge who also Oh no. Looks like he's a purple orca. Not wrong about that. Yeah, he's accurately able to ascertain that. Senseless discrimination, even they know. Are you going to take pity on them because they're the discriminated though? Or are you going to still go ham on the humans? They don't, they don't. Okay, that answers my question very fast. Poison plant, Zovnir's garden of something. Shouts out to father, not letting anything happen to his peeps. So since they're following the base, they're going to pass over Hodge. They're going to see Hodge is being attacked. Y'all got to do something. This is a tricky situation. I think both of them are correct. Obviously, Nazel being the elitist that he is, he would say the more important people, nobles, royals, you know, people of class and stature in the capital, and there's a vast number of more people in general in the capital as well, need to be protected. But Asta and Yuno are thinking undiscriminately, just like that elf was talking, no, we need to save everyone as a kingdom, including our hometown. Now, obviously, they're a little biased because it's their hometown, but uh, I got to I gotta lean more towards Asta and Yuno in this situation. Okay. Let's deal with this quickly, and then we'll catch up to you guys. That's kind of big, though, that he's that he's saying you're going to come with me to protect the castle. I think he uh, has seen somewhat of her talents and uh, respects her, but isn't going to show it. He went from being deemed unnecessary to being a vital, important person in this mission. She loves that. That would be horrible. That'd be a horrible way to go. Reminds me of uh, Gordon's poison magic. I wonder why he never used it, you know? Yeah. They suffer. They go through hardships. But they are living the best they can. I 100% agree, sister. <laughs> I remember this. Is this their first time coming back to Hodge since they left? No, you know came back, I remember, right? To help with that one mission? Garden of Lingering Burns. That's what he said earlier. Jesus. Okay, Nash. No, Asa and Yuna are going to protect him. <laughs> that's me. I'm trying. I'm starting to cry, Lily. I know. That's such a dope shot. Oh, man. Father, come on. I'm right there with them. I got chills. No! No! God damn it.
I knew I was worried about Hodge. I was more worried that the Eye of the Midnight Sun themselves would come over and cause some havoc. And But it does make sense why they'd go straight for the capital. The most magic collection. You know, the biggest mana area. All these people they can just kill and destroy indiscriminately. But uh, there's a magic knight who reincarnated as well in Hodge. And was poisoning. That, that seems like one of the worst ways to go. Your skin's just like burning. Oh, that sounds horrible. But... I love uh, Lily's resolve, and I love Nash, especially thinking about Asa and you know, and how they motivated him, and how they said, "Hey, we're leaving now. We're gonna protect. You know, we're gonna count on you. You're the biggest bro here now." And as a big bro, he was willing to go in and face that head on like a real one. Shouts out to Asa and you know, you know, not sacrificing the mission, but they have to take a detour, protect their own. This is a part of the Clover Kingdom as well. No arguments there. Completely respect that. Got to protect their people. Shouts out Nazel and Noel for going to protect the castle, the capital, all that jazz. Shouts out to Nazel saying, Noel, no, we need you over here. You're a, a vital. Me he didn't say all that, but it was implied. She, he, she's a vital member of the squad and is very needed for what we're going to do so the fights are only going to get crazier and shit's only going to get like i completely un i completely understand how you guys said this is one of the best arcs and it only gets better from here and i completely can buy into that now we should have a couple episodes for a new opening so i believe because this was 101 I believe the next two episodes you guys are going to get are going to be a free full length. So that'll be fun for you guys. Uh, super enjoyable, though. Very much uh, enjoy this this episode. I cannot wait to see us single handedly deal with this magic knight. Get him out of here. I do like Nozel's resolve, though, that was like, we're going to protect the, the Clover Kingdom, whether it be at the cost of our lives, our brother's lives, whatever. We need to do whatever it takes. And I respect that. I respect that. I can't wait till him and Mary Leona and Asta and Noel see Fuegolian back with Salamander and a firearm. Ooh, I'm so excited. I, I gotta keep watching. If you guys enjoyed, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below. Don't forget to subscribe. Check out that Patreon if you guys want early access or full length. Four episodes ahead. Click that bell so you guys always know exactly when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Follow all the social medias. Instagram, Twitch, TikTok, Twitter. All the Dapper Darius. Much appreciated. Don't forget to drink some water. Be safe. Tell someone you love them. Have a great day, Dapper Squad. Peace.